You're a support class. The girl shook her head. I've never heard of it. What job do you have? Huh? White mage? Whispering kicked up behind me while the woman gave me a look of disbelief. White mage? I've never heard of that either. Really? Who casts healing spells? Healing? So, you're like a priest. The girl's eyes widened. How can you be a priest and not be associated with the church? I let out a cough, realizing that my harmless line of questioning was starting to bring a lot of eyes on me that I didn't want. I clearly needed to understand more about this world, and given the chatter behind me and the weird looks, I was in a bad position. Ah, about dungeons. Is there any dungeon around? I decided to change the subject. The girl shrugged. Without any combat prowess, there is no chance you'll be able to make it in a dungeon. You might as well give up. You need to find a group of people willing to drag you around, but if all you can do is heal wounds, that is not something of value. I don't see any party being willing to pick up a... What did you call it? White mage. Seriously, was I so entirely out of line that healing wasn't valued in this world? Well, it wasn't like I was planning on being teleported to another world in the first place. I was just trying to play a game. In that case, I was utterly screwed over if I had a job I couldn't even use. Before I could say another word to the woman, there was a bell that started ringing. The bell wasn't localized in the adventuring guild. Instead, it was something that rang throughout the entire city. The girl blinked. Perhaps you're luckier than you look. Your services might be needed soon enough. Eh? Hey? I asked as the adventuring guild suddenly exploded into action. People started running around the room as if in a hurry. Some were grabbing their equipment and arming up. Others were passing messages. I looked around in confusion as the bustle seemed to grow. A glance out of a window revealed it was the entire city that appeared to have gone nuts. A single ring from this bell and now everyone was running around. People were ducking indoors and closing windows while others were running out with weapons drawn. Excuse me, I finally got notice of the girl once again. Can I ask what is going on? The girl shot me a look of disbelief but then shrugged a moment later. The city is under attack. That is a call to arms. You should stay back here and heal the adventures that return. Based on how many you heal, you'll be paid accordingly. As soon as she finished explaining these things, she grabbed a bag full of equipment and headed out to deliver it to the front lines. Most of the other people also left too, heading for wherever the front lines were. Within a few moments, I was standing in the adventuring guild completely alone. Well, this wasn't what I expected.